Welcome back. You stay with us from AM Show and News Desk. Now, let's get chatting about some of the issues closest to your heart. Hello, good morning, and welcome to Join News Interactive. Time for us to hear from you on some of the most topical issues in Ghana and abroad. We are live on Join News channel on Multi TV as well as Go TV channel on 421 and DSTV channel on 144. Share your views on WhatsApp. 0560 800,000 and on Facebook and Twitter you can follow us on Join News on TV. My name is Victor Brache. If your devices are charged, let's get started. First on the bill this morning is the annual Sikaman Facebook Award started by Ata Nana Are Damwa with a number of his closest friends. This year there are 77 categories including Sikamanian of the Year. Yes, Bright Simons at nomination and then we have most popular Sikamanian, the electoral commissioner charlotte osei and we have yewo chroma of the year bodoma st john head of marketing for apple music she is ghanian you know and four we have most lucrative job proof checker of the electoral commission uh, presidential forms and we have setewa of the year the disqualification of Dr. Parkinson Indium of the PPP by the Electoral Commission of the Presidential Election. It was shocking that we have set as a uh, moment of the year, uh, an event that finally happened after a long time of expectation or postponement. The dismissal by the Human Rights Court in Accra in August of, uh, of the case brought by suspended NPP national chairman Paul Afoko against his party, challenging the legality of his suspension. And then we have U10 of the year. You have a tie between the debatable demand for a debate after declining an early debate and non-payment or payment of trainee nurses allowances and then we have shifting target of the year the number of new community senior high schools to be completed by close of this year the number changed from 170 to 123 to 70 and to 42 and then we have master stroke of the year the second of a failed promiser by a serial promiser when the power minister was sacked most misunderstood phrase suck when it comes to mind pro bono one of the nominees for facebook journalist of the year is our own manasse azure awini followed by the um, daily graphic senior court reporter mabel aku banase so there are a couple of some of these people who were mentioned when yesterday nana arred and washed post on his facebook well, asking people to vote for the Asikaman um, Awards nominees. So we can go to Nana Arre's Damwa page. And two hours ago, he shared which couple had their wedding trending most on Facebook, hashtag Sikaman uh, Facebook Awards. And then Lawrence Kwafu comes in to say, Honorable Rudney Nkrumah and his SW3, laughing aloud, Shake um, says, Team OA. Elizabeth Elam Kofi says that is very, very, very Kwabna Opoku Ajeman and Amma Opoku Ajeman. And we have Elizabeth Elam Kofi who says Team O. And the next one uh, on his wall is what event, personality, story, or message is your highest? Into brackets, not to be forgotten for 2016. And then there are 13 comments and 8 likes. Pat Gary comes in to say, Nana Ado's emphatic win over JDM. Silla says, Muntia 3 and Nana's win. Mame Ia Amwa Mensa says, Nana's percentage. If the answer comes in to say, um, okay, we, we can read Kwabna Awo and Hene Champo. He says, The brush, uh, brush Gate. Uh, we have Kofi Asamwa, Muntia 3. Nandi Blay says, Nana's win. Besiaba. Abba Mansa says Standobe's Blues. I, I'm trying to imagine what she's talking about. But we have Amma Kwapon saying our only general mosquito fashion guru from women's coat to Sam's heart. And then we have Echia Kusidapa who says Nanado's emphatic win and cook 
Koku's comfortable lead, not forgetting Jonah Mosquito's cruise to victory. And we have Lawrence coming back to say, Ni Ayi Bonte's endorsement, laughing out loud. And then Ray and Nimanko says, Muntie Tre. Anthony Ochi says, Muntie Tre. That was the ultimate definition of the kind of leadership President Mahama provided this country. Uh, it also completely changed my perception of the Ministry of Education. Prop Nana Opoku Ajuma, that's the, what the N represents. And we have Mami Jane says, the Muntie Fre and Nanado's emphatic gargantuan win. That Pat Gary says, Muntie Fre, Pat Gary comes again, says, Nanado's emphatic win over GDM. Then Silla comes back to say, Muntie Fre and Nanaya's win. There are other posts that he shared on as well. We'll be reading some few comments. No, he talked about, he, he, he shared a post about, um, the most influential person on Facebook, the most lucrative job on Facebook, the, the page on Facebook which shared or broadcast a lot of things concerning the elections. There are a lot of posts he shared that brings people's mind to what really happened prior to election, during election and after election. We'll be going on to Mabel's page and then read a few comments from what um, she has been writing um, since the beginning of election and even the beginning of the year because the question was who is your favorite um, Facebook journalist of the year so we'll be reading um, a post from Mabel's page and um, that is um, and I read it said I gathered the guy who fixed the stickers on the buses charged hundred C's for each bus and yet our beloved Ghana was built 2,000 cities. The intriguing part of is he is yet to fully recover his cost. Ghana pays more on goods and services than individuals. This is a normal practice. People sit in their offices and inflate figures because the very people who are to protect Ghana are mostly part of the looting brigade or in it. Then we have the next line, which is we should not just sit and complain. We will, okay, it says we all have a role to play in stopping the bleeding of our taxes. God bless our whistleblowers. You, we need more whistleblowers to save this country from greedy businessmen, women, civil servants, and politicians. And then, and then the last two paragraphs, and I read the other paragraph, says let's start by pushing for an overhaul of the Public Procurement Act and the way it's implemented. Ghana deserves better. The last paragraph says, we cannot sit and fold our arms and leave this country's destiny in the hands of politicians and non-performing civil servants. Open your eyes wherever you are. And then there are some few comments under it. And then Nana Ajua Acha comes and says, um, hem, hmm, memory, sorry for that. Uh, and Sa Asari Justice says, I guess Ghanaians did not understand the meaning of the democratic process we clamored for in the early days of the 80s. Democracy has underpinning of a free market economics where the rich gets richer and the poor poorer. And we have Abaye Odro uh, uh, Ufosu who says investigative journalism. So this is a particular post the Mavis has shared on her page. There are other, other posts that she shared that has got to do with some of these right right up we are we have your christmas song for the day for you let's go for a quick break when we come back we have a little thing Jingle bells, 
Christ. Welcome back. This is still Victor Brache, and this is JNI on your Multi TV. Now, you shared your views about this Christmas and then your previous Christmas memories. Now, we have a lot of people talking about what they remember in the past about Christmas from 2008, 2009, 2010. People have been sharing their memories with us on Facebook. So we're gonna get on our Facebook wall and read to you some of the comments that people shared with us. And we have Prince Nuruddin who says, visiting Christian brothers and sisters in order to have fun. That is his Christmas memory. Then we have Ben for Richmond who says, I used to shoot the bamboo gun to disturb neighbors. And then we have Sana Mohammed who writes, Merry Making. So what are your fondest memories if we ask you to share um, Christmas memories with us? What are some of the fondest things you have uh, experienced before? You can still be with us on Facebook to share your comments with us. But the outgoing minister for Environment, Science and Innovation, uh, Mahama Ayarega, has signed a deal and we, we shared that post on our Facebook call and he says, I want to leave a legacy. Ayarega defends 18 million euro contract signed after um, the defeat of the government. And then there are some posts, uh, there, there are some views that people have shared concerning this particular article that was written by my journal line. And it says, Mohammed comes in to say, do you just say legacy? Ha ha ha. Do you remember, and then he comes in with the I word, on the president's elect, you should rather consider the, the, the contract cancelled before he is sworn in. And we have uh, Judicious Odro who says, we understand your corrupt legacy to your children. That's why you said JM to us. Okay, some of these comments. And we have Ebenezer K. Uh, a -a who says, this, money, this man is funny. You know this contract you are defending will terminate when NPP comes to power. We have Lily Wells who says, haha, you have done, you have been in power for eight years now. That is left with three weeks to leave office is the time you want to leave um, a legacy. And then he continues with his with her comment. And we have Kojo Brew who says, there is bad legacy and good legacy. Which one do you want to leave with this kind of action? immoral and unethical. We have Prince Miles who says, haha, this is a legacy. You would rather putting yourself into trouble, incompetent. That's why he ends with. Then we have Akresi, uh, someone who says, we will cancel all oh, corruption people legacy. And then Elvis Osei says, yes, legacy of theft. Um, Eric Batsa says, a month to four, to your four years of reign. How convenient is this contract? So this is, this is what people are, um, are saying under uh, our post on, on, on Facebook uh, where we shared the 18 million uh, euro contract signed by the outgoing minister. Um, but Facebook has rolled out a new policy that gives users the opportunity or the option to select a friend to manage their accounts after their death called the legacy contact or contract sorry the legacy contact it will enable you to control certain aspects of your page like your profile and header image after you die when i mean your profile id and your cover page that's what i mean to say also gives you the option to have your account deleted after you pass away seems a bit morbid but 
still something that everyone on the social media platform have to think about. But what do you think about it? I'm going to take you through what the legacy contact is in a very quick uh, way. So a legacy contact is someone you choose to look after your account if it is being memorialized and then it says once your account is memorialized um, your legacy contact will have the option to do things like you say a write a pinned post for your profile into bracket that is to share a final message on your behalf or provide information about a memorial service and then the second one is respond to your respond to new friend requests and then into bracket it says old friends or family members who weren't yet on your facebook and then we have update your profile picture and cover picture you will also have the option to allow uh, your legacy contact to download a copy of what you have shared on facebook and we may add additional capabilities for legacy contacts in the future your legacy contact cannot cannot log into your account he or she cannot remove or change past posts, photos, and other things shared on your timeline, and also read your messages, and also remove any of your friends. So these are some of the things that your legacy contact cannot do. And then as I read earlier, some of the things that your legacy contact can do. Let's go to our Facebook where we share the post. Um, asking people, Facebook, I mean, about this legacy contact. And then uh, we ask people what they think about this feature introduced by Facebook. Um, Prince Nuruddin says, I think it's a good move, but managing the disease account could generate sad memories. Sana Mohammed says, that is really good, but after your death, the person is supposed to deactivate your account. Ben for Richmond says, I think it's a good move, but whom to trust is the question. Then we have Nambi Patrick, who says, why always Facebook? I beg, let's support and also use our own Ghanaian social media platforms like kalasocial.com, sweetie.com, etc., etc. And we have um, Saved Sweet, who says, so I tried the sweetie.com and it's still loading for, okay. And then there are other comments below. Uh, we have Kavana. Uh, Munash who says oh really and then save come back and say means Castro can now post his pictures we live to see so these are some of the comments that people are sharing on our Facebook wall regarding the new feature that Facebook has introduced so you can also join us on our Facebook or share with us your, your views about what is happening on social media, the new feature being introduced, about the 18 million euros that the minister, the contract, uh, minister has signed before he steps out of office, and then some other things that are trending. And then what it means is that 2012 and 2016 um have probably uh, have this same issues you know in 2012 we had an election and in 2016 we've had an election we can do the comparison whether when the government in 2012 were you know being taken over for 2016 they also did a similar thing by passing or you know signing some of these contracts so yeah this has been join news interactive with me victor brache god bless you and join us in the tomorrow